Okay, guys, I tried to go live, and I couldn't get it to do it right, so recap of everything. I've used my e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. I used it all over, including my eyes. Then I used, well, actually, first, I used this. It's the Yensa Color Face Tone Up Primer Essential Glow. I love it. Got to get some more of it. Then I used my e.l.f. Putty Primer. I even put it on my eyes. And I started with D4 in the crease, as you can see. And I'm trying to buff that out as best as possible. But I found with the primer on your eyes, once that blue hits it, it's staying put. So if you are new to the colors like I am, it's probably best to try it without the primers first. So I'm just going in with my uh, Tetris brush and trying to buff that out as best as possible. I didn't realize that with the poreless face stuff on there that it was going to stick, like stick, stick. So now I'm going to go in with um, the A2, this real pretty purple right above it and I'm kind of buff it in to that blue, try to anyway. Boy, that just made it really dark. Like, I don't know what to do, guys. I'm really bad at this blending thing. I've got to get better at it because if not, it's going to just make me look like a clown. And I really don't... I, do, I wasn't going to go for like a dark color, but I guess that's what I'm doing because it's really purple. Sorry, guys. I'm going to put this in front of my face real quick just to check the, the color. So I'm going to do that again on the next eye. I'm just going to go right into that blue at the very top and try to buff it into that. Wow, that is really purple. My favorite color is purple, by the way, guys. What is your guys' favorite colors? Do you have more than one favorite color? Or is there just one favorite color? Now, I, I, I know people are gonna laugh at me because I use the same brush and maybe I shouldn't have. I think I learned my lesson because it's like, Making it muddy, I guess is what they call it. And I'm just trying to buff it. I like the color though. So I guess what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just put a lighter color in that, like this area here, because the cut crease takes me so long. And yesterday I made a video and it was like, 23 minutes long and I could not could not upload it for the life of me so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put just a little bit of let's see what can I put there sorry guys I'm not trying to be like away from the camera I've got my makeup room set up and I've got to make a better way to do these videos. I've got to get like a, a camera that can pan around or whatever. So I grabbed my NYX eyeshadow base. It's really, it's got like a shimmer to it, but it's, it's really good for the eye to make it light. So I'm going to add that to just the part of the eye that hasn't gotten anything on it. I guess it's like a cut crease. But I'm, and I'm applying this with my finger, guys. I know people don't suggest that, but I'm me, and that's the way I put it on most times because it's just easier for me. So, And that's the way it looks. 
I'm gonna go in with a different brush, obviously, because I've learned my lesson about using the same brush. And I'm gonna use my Ulta little bitty round brush. And I really wanted to put like some green there, but there's no green in this palette. So I think what I'm gonna do is go into A5, it's a really pretty pink. And I'm gonna just dab my brush in there. I'm gonna try not to get too much. And I'm going to put it just over that NYX eye primer. not coming out the way I wanted it to guys so has everyone had the chance to do a look I haven't been on YouTube to actually look to see if anyone else has done a look with one of these palettes I know Karen has and I love Karen's channel I love her ideas and I've watched Paige's channel, and I love her channel too. I love all your guys' channels. It gives me insight on the things that I need to learn, like better blending. <laughs> Can you guys see that? Like, I don't know if I didn't blend that properly but I don't think that this right here, I think I should work on blending that out better. And I think maybe it's my brushes. Maybe I need to clean my brushes, I don't know. But I like that so far. But I think the look needs some green to it. I'm bored, Samantha's normally with me, guys. I like that so far. So that's what I'm gonna do with the other eye. And I'm just gonna go in with my finger again, of course. And then I'm going to grab some more of that pink A5. And I'm gonna go right on top of that. And you guys tell me, what is the best eye primer that you guys use? Because I've been using different things and I have very dry skin during the winter. So I need to know what's good for the eyes as a primer. And this cell phone videoing just ain't cutting it. I'm gonna have to get a camera. I really need to learn to blend out better. Anyway guys, I'm not going to add anything else to this because I think I've already, like, messed this look up. So, this will be a flop video, but at least I tried. And that's what counts, you guys. That's It, it counts that you try. And I want to know, in the comments below, guys, tell me what is best that you've found for dry skin because I have eczema and I have psoriasis and it's very hard during the winter to wear makeup because like right up and through here in in my eyebrows and down into my nose and even here I get red scaly patches and I have to put multiple layers of um, 
lotions and things like that. And some of them aren't too so good because they burn. Of course, when you have psoriasis, you can't use certain things. So in the comments below, give me some ideas on what I should use for my skin this winter. Um, if you guys have come across anything that's good for eczema and psoriasis that, you know, nobody would think of, let me know in the comments below. And let me know if you guys think that green, like a lime green would look good in this. And comment and hit that like button, please. And subscribe or share, preferably all of the above. You guys have a good night. I'm going to go cook Sam and Shylan dinner. And let me know, do I need to put some green in this? You guys have a good night.